Meeting lots of new people here today at Evans Mills Raceway Park. Of course, last time I was here, there was clay on the surface, and the guy's dad, who I'm interviewing now, was out there having some fun as well. Josh Vern Jr. is in his first year in an asphalt late model. He spent two years here in a four-cylinder. They call them sport compacts here. He won 20 races at a couple of track championships, so he did pretty darn well, so this is obviously the next progressive step. Two wins this year. He also leads in points, and, of course, his dad is somebody I know pretty well, and a lot of you guys in dirt do as well. Josh, how we doing, man? Good. How about yourself? Doing very well. Sounds like we're enjoying a great season. Uh, yeah, we're doing good. Um, had a couple weeks where we've had some bad luck or else, you know, I think we got two wins, four or five seconds, so leading the points, so everything's going good. What was the adjustment like doubling your cylinders uh, at this track? Uh, it's a small track, so, I mean, just a little bit of throttle control, learning how to not spin the tires and mm -hmm. just going a little faster. Everything else is pretty adjustable. Tell me about the car. Uh, the car is good. Um, Obviously, first year, we're still trying to learn. Um, mostly just tire adjustments, and now we've been a couple seconds here in a row, so we're trying some new things to get a little better. I know there's a couple of different engine options you can go with. Which are you? Yeah, we're uh, we're a crate motor. Um, okay, two-barrel. So, yep. Yeah, we're trying to get... Uh, I just think it's easier for me first year to get the power to the track and, you know, just learn and keep the momentum up. and. Mm -hmm. Standard, like a two-speed, like we'd have in a sportsman or a modified? Like a, like a sportsman. Okay, hand clutch or foot clutch? Foot clutch. Okay, but it engages as you push it yep. in, correct? Correct. Okay. Uh, did that take some getting used to going from the four-cylinder, or did you slide right into that? Uh, I did drive my dad's sportsman twice, so it was I kind of already had the knowledge of knowing what to do. But, yeah, a little foot, it was a little bit of an adjustment, but mm -hmm. everything came pretty smoothly yeah and hand clutch obviously in the sportsman but the same idea yep. the clutch engages the gear where in your car you push the clutch in you, you right. disengage the gear rear wheel drive or front wheel drive in the four cylinders uh it was a front wheel drive so there was some adjusting there too then wasn't there i mean I imagine it's a different feel in yeah, the corners definitely did that take some time uh we came out for practice our first time and the lap times were pretty close so you know just getting smoother every lap and being consistent that mm -hmm. was the biggest thing i see they have traction compound down on the outsides do we use that or we tend to hug the hub uh i've always learned around here that the bottom's always the fastest at least for me mm -hmm. so i've been trying to stay smooth down there and you know if i got to go to the top you got to go to the top but okay. the track compound the tires don't really like it that much our tires are lasting longer on the bottom so we're just oh. trying to do what we got to do to get to the front that's surprising i would have figured You'd scrub off more speed on the bottom, you'd wear more tires that way. But no, that's not the case. No, it's it's just you don't going in on the top, you gotta keep your momentum up more for me, so you gotta drive it in harder and they get hotter quicker. And gotcha. yeah. Where would we like to be someday? Are you plotting out your race career? Uh I'm looking kinda of to follow in the old man's footsteps and go somewhere on dirt. Okay. Uh we've been looking around for sportsmen, but Hard just, to find from what I hear, right? <laughs> yeah, just a lot of money. We're just waiting to find the right deal, and we're trying to get our knowledge built up so we're not just jumping in the class. I understand. Knowing nothing. So. Okay. Well, maybe I'll get a chance to see you win later on tonight. And, <laughs> yeah, uh, that's the goal. This has been nice. Now, again, I know a lot of you guys, you know, we're primarily dirt, and you know his dad from this. So if you're interested in all this stuff, hit that blue E. It'll subscribe you, send you notifications, like all that good stuff. Good to meet you, Josh, and I hope you have fun tonight. All right, thank you.